Good evening to you. Well, indeed, as you've just heard, we are beginning to see the light at the end of the tunnel, but it's still very faint indeed, and as far as tomorrow's concerned, it'll be just as cold as ever. After that, though, as this area of high pressure begins to pull away into the continent, then I think we have every chance of seeing, at least in some western parts, the winds coming in from a more westerly po point, so somewhat less cold, and a chance of a begin of the slow thaw. But let's look at the satellite picture first of all, and as you can see, at least as far as tonight's concerned, it's more or less clear skies all the way, so another very cold night over most parts of the country. But there is an area of cloud creeping down the North Sea at the moment, and this will be feeding onto these easternmost counties, perhaps bringing the odd light snow shower, but more important than that, taking the edge off the severe frost. And as far as tonight's concerned, it is a widespread frost just about everywhere. And in central and western parts especially, once again, a very severe frost. In fact, near Shrewsbury, the temperature's already as low as that. And there'll be some patches of fog around in those areas to go with it. That eastern slice, though, will have rather more in the way of cloud and the odd light snow shower, but uh, a frost just the same. And those eastern counties tomorrow, actually, will keep that area of cloud, the odd little bit of sleet and snow in the breeze, but uh, some sunny intervals in between. Central and western parts, though, the fog around to begin with, most of it clearing, but not all, and then once it's gone, a dry day with sunny periods. <laughs>